in the offense. Tom R., you got to do something about it. Mark Rogers, he'd be the voice of college football here in the Infocision Stadium on the campus of the University of Akron. Talking Zips football, 4-8 and eight last year, 2-6 and six in the MAC. Terry Bowden fired after seven seasons. Mostly downers, but there were a few highlights. They did win a bowl game against Utah State in 2015, won a division championship in 2017 en route to the MAC championship game. All right, let's focus on 2019 and an offense that needs serious, serious help. 126th in the nation in rushing, 2.9 yards per carry. Number 124 in scoring at under 19 points per game. Cato Nelson, though, a multi-purpose quarterback, 15 TDs, eight picks. He's pretty good, 2,300 yard passing, 500 yards rushing. It revolves around him on offense, but he need help from the running game. They bring in Deltron Sands, an Oregon State transfer. Also their prize recruit from Orlando, Peter Hayes Patrick. The wide receivers are actually pretty good on this team, probably the best unit on either side of the football. Audrey Williams led the group with 46 catches last year. The defense for the Zips, it was decent last year, but they lose eight starters. They bring back their best player, safety, all-MAC first-teamer, Alvin Davis, 75 tackles, four picks last year. And then, of course, you got uh, John Lacko. This guy is a wrecking machine at linebacker with 126 tackles. The Akron schedule, pretty light, pretty light out of conference as well. No big powerhouses to take on. They've got Illinois in week one on the road. Kent State went to Illinois last year and had a two touchdown lead. Then they welcome Conference USA champion UAB here to InfoStation Stadium in week two. Would love to hear what you have to say about Akron football right here at Mark Rogers TV, the voice of college football.